we have an outbreak that has spread around the world rapidly through new modes of transmission about which we understand too little and which meets the criteria in the international health regulations. For all of these reasons, I have decided that the global monkeypox outbreak represents a public health emergency of international concern. I have made a set of recommendations for four groups of countries. First, those that have not yet reported a case of monkeypox or have not reported a case for more than 21 days. Second, those with recently imported cases of monkeypox and that are experiencing human-to-human -human transmission. This includes recommendations to implement a coordinated response to stop transmission and protect vulnerable groups, to engage and protect affected communities, to intensify surveillance and public health measures, to strengthen clinical management and infection prevention and control in hospitals and clinics, to accelerate research into the use of vaccines, therapeutics, and other tools, and recommendations on international travel. The third group of countries is those with transmission of monkeypox between animals and humans. And the fourth is countries with manufacturing capacity for diagnostics, vaccines, and therapeutics. Although I'm declaring a public health emergency of international concern, for the moment, this is an outbreak that's concentrated among men who have sex with men, especially those with multiple sexual partners. That means that this is an outbreak that can be stopped with the right strategies in the right groups. It's therefore essential that all countries work closely with communities of men who have sex with men to design and deliver effective information and services and to adapt measures that protect the health, human rights, and dignity of affected communities. With the tools we have right now, we can stop transmission and bring this outbreak under control.